sometimes we do hear from singles complaining it's difficult to find a quality person to date these days. Where should you go to, to look to find a match? And then where do you go on a date? <laughs> well, Stephanie Sandwin has a decade under her belt in the matchmaking industry. She is founder of the website called StephInTheCity.com and she's here today to help all the single people with some good ideas and expensive ideas as well. Good to see you, Sarah. Good to see you, too. You so say you don't have to spend a whole lot of money to have a good time. No, there's so many options out there, and we're in such a great city. So, you know, there's there's so many things that people forget sometimes mm -hmm. that are great opportunities than just going to dinner and a movie. Right. And people, you know, people really need to take advantage, especially when you have hot weather. So are you saying that also when you take advantage of some of these things, you're also going to meet people, too, and that may be one way to find That's good people to date rather than going online? Absolutely, because a lot of people, a lot of companies like kayaking and paddle boating, mm -hmm. they actually have, not only do they have something for if you're single, because they have a fitness night. So if you wanted to, you know, to go and try out, you know, paddle boarding sure. or kayaking, they have a fitness night, and a lot of people who are going to go there are going to be single as well, but they also have a, a romantic sunset, um, sunset option so you can go with a date. It's so pretty, ah, too. People are quality so pretty. people that way, too, and look, <laughs> enjoy it. And they, then the they enjoy what you're, you're uh -huh. enjoying, and you know, you know that they are fitness-oriented. Well, so that's the key, I think, is, is uh, go where the people you like are. <laughs> they like some of the activities that you yeah, like to do as do. well. Now, yeah. you've got something called the City Solve Urban Race. Everybody, you know, everybody loves some of these, like, you know, um, exciting things. Everyone thinks of the amazing race, I think, oh, that they got right. into that. Yes. This is your own opportunity, and it's, it's in fun and adventure, and it's less physical than a 5K, but you get trivia, you get pop culture and world history, and it's team-oriented. And people are going in groups of two to four. Um, you still have 12 clues, and this year they have over 800 it's racers. It's so fun, isn't it? Yeah. It's, it's absolutely fun, and we actually have a discount code on your okay. website so oh, that you can get cool. it cheaper. Okay. All right. All right. Okay. So what about something about uncooking creativity? What's that all about? Well, we've got <laughs> Bottle and Bottega. It's Chicago's first BYLB wine and party studio. You combine um, art instruction by local artists with the, BO, um, with the BYOB concept, and it's you get to do this for about three hours, for about you know 35 to 45 um, dollars. You can go with a date. They also have their own opportunities like single and mingle, tapas Tuesdays and Fiesta Fridays. So that not only do they have an opportunity that you can go with a group, mm -hmm. that you can go with a group, but they also have singles nights as well. Okay. So all right, if dinner is too expensive, mm -hmm. just dessert. Well, if you if <laughs> for, for the ladies out there and for the gentlemen, uh -huh. um, Ladies Night Chicago has a night of chocolate fashion and shopping. Oh. Uh -uh. So you can't go wrong, and for only $20, you, get, you can be pampered. They will have um, people doing hair and makeup and massage. And of course, getting to enjoy chocolate and getting to be um, to mingle. That so sounds that's, dangerous. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so that's a ladies' night, and so if a guy wants to wander in, in there, there's going to be lots of ladies to meet. There'll be lots of ladies to meet, and a lot of guys don't realize that this is a great, you know, great opportunity to meet single ladies. And it's also advertised if you are, if you just want to go for a ladies' night out, if you are married. Mm -hmm. So again, you know, oh, these yeah. opportunities. There's opportunities. It's, if you're single, you don't just have to go to something that's marked singles. You can find these activities right. out here. And a lot of these, if you take a good look at something like Yip It Chicago or other things that there are discounted codes, a lot of these activities um, you can you can buy on a Groupon type of website. Okay, it doesn't have to cost that much. Now, Stephanie has lots more dating ideas that don't have to cost a lot of money. We didn't have time to cover all of them. So they are listed, however, on our website. Go to abc7chicago.com. You will find them listed there when you click on the See It on TV tab. Thanks very much. Thanks for having me. And we'll be right back.